let's just um, get focus. I'm just going to scramble it. When I scramble, I just try and get it so that there are no adjacent colours, if it's possible, and the yellows are, um, and have those blues up. Perhaps it's an impossible dream. Okay, it's pretty close. Right, so I'm just going to go through a complete solution here, um, and I'll try and explain exactly all the steps I'm doing. So, as you may remember from the last video, the idea is to start off on the yellow top, which is going to be the top face with white on the bottom, um, going to try and make a daisy. So that means bringing f four white pieces up to here. Well, I've, by luck, I've got one there. Here's one. So I need to bring this up to the top face. So if I turn it to there and then up to there, it puts it in, but it doesn't touch that one that was there already. So let's find another one. Here's one. So this one has got to go, well, it's going to go up to there. So I turn it. If I do that, it's wrong because it's it needs to have the white on top. So I'd actually turn it to there, then turn that through 90 degrees, and then bring it up. So now we've got three. Now I'm just going to find the, oh, there is the fourth, and it's easy. Just turn it straight up. Okay, so the yellow daisy, yellow middle, four white petals. Now we've got to find line these up and then turn them through 180 all the way down. So this one is lined up with its centre, so we can turn that all the way down. This one isn't, so I'll just try and find the blue centre, which is over here. And so that's matched there, so we can turn that all the way down. This one isn't, so let's just move that around. The red, so now it's lined up with red, now I can turn it all the way down. And this one, just got to find the green centre, which I happen to know is opposite blue, so go all the way around and turn it all the way down. So now we've got a white cross, but the difference is that that's orange, orange, green, green, red, red, blue, blue. So now what we want to do is complete this face to bring in the four corners with their white face facing up. So the best way to do that is to put the white face down and then first of all have a look on top. So let's see if we've got one here. So that is... That is one of the white corners. So that is the um, green red corner. Um, so we need to match it to the between the green and the red, which is actually where it happens to be. So it's in the right place because this green matches that and this red matches that. These colours are washed out on this camera. So anyway, um, so now we just need to bring it down to put it in this corner. So the way we do that is the famous right sexy move. So you turn away, towards, back, back. And that has now moved it. Uh, where do I put it? Well, actually, it's gone straight in. So that's now in place. So let's work on this next one. So this one is blue and red. So we find the blue and red. And this one is going to go into this corner here. So once again, start doing sexy moves, right sexy moves. So turn away, towards, back, back. And it's gone into there, but it's not right yet. So it's got to happen again. So away, towards, back, back. It's now in this position, um, which still isn't where we want it. So away, towards, back, back. And now it has gone into position. So it's just a case of doing that away towards back back, which is also known as the right sexy move, until we get that position that down into position. Now this is this white one is green and orange, so let's find. So there's green and orange, so it goes above those two cut two centres, and it's going to go into this position here. So I go away towards back back. And it's gone into the square, but it's still not right, so it needs to do that again. Away, towards, back, back. That's brought it up to the top. Away, towards, back, back. And now it's gone into position. So finally, there's just this one left, which is the blue, orange, with white. So go around until we find there's the blue, there's the orange. So it's above them, and it's going to go into here. So away, towards, back, back away towards back back away towards back back 
away, towards, back, back, and this time towards, back, back. Now it's gone into position. So that has solved this face, and we've got all green with a green centre, all orange with an orange centre, all blue with a blue centre, and all red with a red centre. So the next step is to try and put these edges in. So to go in there we need one with it, which has got red and blue. But I'm not going to be specific about that, in fact. Oh, there it is actually. Oh, well, let's do that one then. So put it so it's... So that's the red blue which needs to go into that space there. So put it so it's matching its center. This is the space you want it to go into. So you actually turn it one quarter turn away from where you want it to be. Then we do one right sexy move and then turn the cube and do one sec left sexy move. So one, two, three. And now that blue red has gone into position. So now we can do the next one. So this is blue orange, it is over the blue centre already. It needs to go into that position between these two. So you turn it away from where it wants to be. And because it's gone on to the right hand side, this time we'll start with a left sexy move. Away, towards, back, back. Then turn the cube through 90 degrees towards the next one you're going to do, which is going to be a right sexy move. Away, towards, back, back. And now it's gone into position. So here is the green red. So put it over the red center. It's green, so it's going to go there. So we actually turn it away from where we want it. It's over there and we want it here. And because it's gone to the left, we're going to do it start on the right. So away, towards, back, back. Turn the cube towards the next turn. And then away, towards, back, back. And let's put that into position. So it's one to go. Um, here we are. So we'll keep going around. So there's green and it's orange and there's orange. So it needs to go into there. So we turn it away from where it wants to go. And because it's gone to the left, we're going to do it start on the right. So a right sexy, which is away towards back, back, turn the cube towards the next turn, then on the left away towards back, back. And now we've solved two layers. So now we've just got this top to be done. Now, when you get to this stage, you need, next need to form a yellow cross. So there's just yellow centre from these four yellow bits. Doesn't matter what the corner's doing at this stage. Now you can actually get here in one of several states. You either have only the yellow centre and there's none of these petals, or there's two at 90 degrees to each other, or you see a straight line across, so one on either side of the yellow centre, which could also be up and down, or all four are done. Well, this is, this is one stage beyond uh, the beam. If, if it was just the yellow dot, then it doesn't matter which side you do this on. But because I've already got two at 90 degrees, I put that up in the, away from me at the top and the back, um, so that... <coughs> It's like it's reading nine o'clock if those were pointers of a clock. And so the, mechan the, the movement this time is you turn one turn on the front face and then do a right sexy move. So, and now you've got a line. So that, and then put the front back. Um, as it happens, I'm about to do that again. But anyway, so that we've gone from a dot to a nine o'clock to a line and then the next stage will be a full yellow cross. So if I turn the front away, front to the side and do one right sexy move and then back again, now we have got a yellow cross. And again, it doesn't matter what the corner is doing at this stage. So the next stage of solving it is, oh, <laughs> it's turned out nicely for me on this occasion. The idea is that these four corners, we're going to try and get them into the right place. And now this is actually going to turn out to be a simple solve because they've actually all gone into the right place. But just to say, this one is yellow, but it's then got red and blue. So it needs to go between red and blue. And ultimately we need yellow facing up. So it's perfectly done. And by complete sort of coincidence, so is this one. So this is red and green with yellow facing up and it's between the red and green centres. 
this one ah oh, is not in the right place okay so there is this is the opportunity to show this so that is actually if you take the yellows are ultimately going to face up that is actually the blue orange corner but it's actually between uh, green and orange and equally this one's also going to be wrong because this is the green orange corner but it's actually between orange and blue so while these two over here are in the right place they're, they're between the right centers these two are switched the wrong way around now there is a quick way to do this but if you just want to stick to doing sexy moves the way you do this is three sexy moves on the right hand side so put the two that you've that you want to keep intact to your left over on this side and then make sure the two that need to be switched are on the right hand side and then the mechanism is going to be three right hand sexy moves and then a quarter turn and then three sexy three left hand sexy moves so away towards back back that was one away towards back back that was two away towards back back that's three now you know it's the right corner when it's got white on top so that now turns to the left before you start doing three left so you can hold it in the middle and do away towards back back that's one away towards oh don't do that back back and then away towards back back now we should find so if we match these up that's the wrong one that's, there it goes there so green orange again doesn't matter the yellow is not facing up yet but green and orange are now between green and orange red and green is between red and green red and blue is between red and blue and blue and orange is between blue and orange so all the four corners are now in the right place so now you can turn the cube the other way up so white faces up so we've picked it sometimes you've got already got a yellow face in the right direction i.e. it's on, on this face but none of these are at the moment but assume you had then you would just take the next one round the first one that's wrong and that is wrong and we're just going to keep on doing right hand sexy moves until that gets to the position where yellow is facing downwards so and it's going to go into place now finish that move now without moving anything else because this is all jumbled up but it'll put itself right again as long as we don't change anything else just bring the next one which isn't which hasn't got yellow facing downwards and bring it round to this corner where we've been working and just do the whole thing again and on the next go it's gone into position so it's now right um, so now we've just bring the next corner which isn't right round so it's got yellow there where it should be here and then you're just going to do more left oh, I think I just did it yeah so that's now got the yellow face round so bring the last one round and we're just going to do it should go in on this occasion and just put straighten this up and so we've still got the two layers and the white face all complete but we've now also completed the yellow face so and oh we've even got a green face that's complete as well which means we've only got three pieces um, that are in the wrong position which is kind of where we came into this video so if you now turn it so the face you have got is towards you do one Hold on, get it right. One right hand sexy move. Our one left. Now I'm going to do five on this side. One. And on this occasion, we should find that we've got the six yellow, which is always a good sign. Now we're going to do five on the left. One, two, three, four, and now if we're 
we're very lucky this cube is solved and that is it so the point being that doing this if I do six of them I should get back to where I started which is good practice if you just keep doing six then you'll find you there and equally with six on the left one two oops, don't do that three four and this one should be uh, <laughs> I've completely screwed it uh, did I miss one? did I, did I lose count? I did yeah, I did five when it should be six. But there you go. Um, yeah, so that is the key to it, is just to keep on doing... So, let's just back now. So, right is away, towards, back, back. 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 There we are, and equally, way towards, back, back, one, way towards, back, back, two, way towards, back, back, three, way towards, back, back, four, way towards, back, back, five, way towards, back, back, six. So just keep doing those because that is absolutely fundamental to it. Um, and that's it. So there you go. The monster's done.